I'm Audrey Noel Potvin. I think I know just about everybody here, and you know me. By the end of this lecture, you will be able to define the difference between functional fitness training and conventional training. You will be able to distinguish the difference uh, between fact and fallacy with regards to functional fitness training. You will be able to explain the benefits, pros and cons of functional fitness training. And finally, implement key training considerations. So functional fitness fallacies, it trains the core stabilizers. How many of you have heard, well I have my client feel when it's turned off. When your transverse abdomen is part of your core muscle stabilizing group, right, is turned off. So then I say take a deep breath in, you take a dumbbell, you squat down trying to get it as close to the floor as you can, you arm curl it up, and then you press up. So they learn the technique first. 